write as a mixed number or a whole number. So we have 8 over 3 and we have to write it as one of those two. So the way I like to do this is I like to think about how many times does 3 go into 8. Well 3 times 1 is 3, so it goes in once for sure. 3 times 2 is equal to 6, so it definitely goes in twice. But if you do 3 times 3, well you get 9, so it doesn't go in 3 times, that's too big. So 3 goes into 8 2 times, because 3 times 2 is 6. So 2, that's the whole number part of our mixed number. So it goes into 8 2 times, and then what's left over? Let's think about that. 3 times 2 is 6, so what's left? How many more numbers do you need to get to 8? Well, 2, right? Because 8 minus 6 is 2. So it's 2 over 3. Boom. I hope this video has been helpful.